What is a feasible budget for homeschool? Hi, this is Dr. Libra answering your homeschool question. And feasible budget, well, it depends on really kind of three ways to think about it. One, I would ask and answer the question, what do you want? So depending on what you want for your kid and what you consider your student, what you consider being uh, homeschooling, uh, that'll affect it. Because if you want to add supplemental courses or uh, art and music and uh, sports and activities, so that price uh, can certainly uh, go up for homeschooling proper, depending on uh, what you're doing. Even that, uh, you can take the price to wherever you want to get to, just about. Now, the second point, though, is there's still the shoestring opportunity. Lots of homeschoolers are uh, respectful and appreciative of homeschooling because it saves them a lot of money. They're not fighting a battle in private school, you know, relationships really in public, too, because there's all kinds of things that go into it in terms of clothing, competition, expectations, and presence, and uh, a variety of things that just make the whole endeavor expensive because of the social dynamics in particular uh, that are involved. I, I would say this, a reasonable budget that you ought to be able to follow uh, very safely would be about one-third of what a private school costs. Uh, that might even be extravagant in some ways, but if you might check in the area and figure out what private school basically costs and use that as a budget, I think you're going to find that to be a, a pretty nice focusing strategy for you. It makes it reasonable, still keeps you efficient, and I hope this helps. Be sure to subscribe to this channel for more videos about homeschooling. If you're interested in our educational courses, visit our website independenthomeschool.com by clicking the link in the description below.